mechanically attached tape seam, two rows of tape and one row of plates or fasteners. One option to complete a mechanically attached seam incorporates one row of 2 and 3 8 inch seam fastening plates with Weatherbond's HP WX fasteners with a row of Weatherbond's 3 inch wide seam tape on both sides of the fasteners. Arrange the 2 and 3 8 inch seam fastening plates so that the center of the plate is 4 and a half inches from the edge of the sheet and fasten 12 inches on center maximum with a Weatherbond HP WX fastener. Position the edge of the overlapping top sheet 8.5 inches from the edge of the bottom sheet and mark the edge the entire length of the sheet. Roll the top sheet back and apply a thin coat of TPO primer on both sides of the seam fastening plates, making sure to prime enough surface area to accommodate the 3 inch seam tape on both sides of the fasteners and plates. The seam tape will be exposed 1 8 of an inch minimum to a half inch maximum when the seam is closed. Seam tape must be in contact with the primed sheet. Allow the primer to dry. Then unroll approximately 3 feet of seam tape and carefully apply the tape to the primed sheet on both sides of the fasteners and plates. Next, apply a thin coat of TPO primer on enough of the sheet to accommodate both areas of seam tape on the bottom sheet. Allow the primer to dry and then close the overlapping seam. Peel off the clear poly starting at the inside of the seam, the edge of the bottom sheet, and apply firm hand pressure towards the outside edge of the seam to remove any trapped air. Remove the poly from the second row of seam tape and apply firm hand pressure working towards the outside edge of the seam to remove any trapped air. Immediately roll the seam with a 2 inch wide roller. Always roll across the seam. Seam tape should be exposed a minimum of 1 8 inch to a maximum of a half inch when the seam is closed. Install a 6 inch by 6 inch T-joint cover at all T-intersections. A bead of lap sealant is required on all seam edges and accessory edges. Lap sealant is also required at all seam tape overlaps.